呃、uh, ，so we have 呃、uh, dongle 是哪个？这是这啊、哦、，sorry， this one， this is 这个、是 this is photoprint rip dongle， and this green one， 呃、uh, is 呃、uh, print exp dongle， so you will need to connect these two dongles， 呃、uh, and can run the print， and this is photoprint。So the computer runs a, a bit slow. So wait. So this is the interface of the photoprint. Some history tasks. Delete. We can delete some tasks when you have printed or. Your sign, sign number. You want to give me a introduction? Ah. Ah. You say no. I will delete. 啊、uh, ，We add the the our model first. So like like when you when you open it, it's like totally new. And we add the model, add a device first. You see, uh, Glorido is our brand, and the soft printer. You need to select HS twelve zero one. Yes, HS twelve zero one, and yes. And it print depend on file, and there's another option TCP IP. It's direct print. File is a rip of a file, and then open print exp to do the printing task. And we will do the file based on file. Finish. Okay, select. Okay, and then we take the file into the. 他弄到哪里了 ？So this is the file. This is the design we just made. Hold it. Okay. So select ICC. 这是我们那个预，这是预设。啊、uh, ，the preset and the. 你可以删除，可以保留。啊、uh, ，here you can select. Delete or hold. Uh, hold means after print the job, the the task will show here. But if you delete, it will dis it will disappear here. So this is ICC. Wait, ICC is long. So ICC. Ah, this is ICC. Yeah. 但我们已经选了这个，其他都是都有的。嗯，设置都是好的，只要是。It's like a default one. 就可以。嗯 ，OK. Okay, so this is like a canvas area which we we have designed here. Actually, we can turn it here. You can change the direction. Ah, change the direction. You see, this can be turned. You want to mirror side or like upside down side, but normally it's like lay laying down this this direction. Yes. So, so this is ready for. We click stand. And、uh, you can、uh, save it in any folder which you want to、uh, save. We save in des desktop, yes. And it's processing a rip file. Uh, this processing depends on your computer, <laughs> so take a few seconds and.、Uh, So, you are not in where? Because I have more data. If this is like this, it is usually printed. Normally, this is a print exp. Uh, you can save in the desk desktop, so you can open it easily. Because we have different models, so. Can this on the desk side? So you can put it in the desktop. Uh, so、uh, when working, you just open it. Only one selection of the option. Yes. So open the print exp. So after it will connect. You see, make sure every time、uh, open the software. So here is uh, like uh, connected. So the printer and the software is online. 
and uh, it detects the dongle. And uh, now we open the file. So this one, this file, yes. Mm. And the date is just today. So this is, uh, um, don't need, the, it's the default one. Don't need to connect anything. And this is the size of the, the artwork. You see 1.2 meters and uh, uh, 25.4 is a parameter of the yeah, we want, yeah we select two two hats both hats printing so so that's it okay go printing and uh, install the roller come on you can't just press it Ah, uh, uh, yeah, we, we test if the we just test the the size is if it's a fit print on paper first and and then we print on socks. Normally just after one test you can go for production like every time the same. Just just do one time. Just print a few lines to to check if the laser um, laser which uh, uh, reflect to the roller if it's uh, correct position. We can stop because it's already have print out. You see, this is the area of the edge. So it's forty five, which we said. Uh, before the socks lens, okay. So also this part, yeah, here this is okay. And uh, then we we'll put another one. Mm, so there's a button. Control the roller. Yeah, here. Yeah. So we make alignment on the socks. And we can turn the roller by uh, use the software. There's arrow. So, wait. This is the arrow which turns the roller up and down, forward and back, backward. So, so make sure the socks, uh, the, 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 the wrong side is well aligned. If necessary, if you want to print a special part of the socks, like one logo here, you can make a, a, another two roller here, another two laser here. So make a, a special position, always same. Mm. Uh, yes, this is we test the height, like uh, see like. Two to three millimeter. The highest part, like a, a heel part, normally is higher than the socks. Other side, other part of socks. So we see if it's uh, it will scratch the nodal surface because uh, if scratch nodal surface, maybe it will make the print head clogged. So it's better to check, uh, especially the the cuff side. And the heel side, so make sure those two sides uh, are higher position, uh, not scratch the um, nozzle surface. So this is two head machine, and also here do the same. We already done, so so we show you. Okay, so we click print.
So this is printing, and after it's done, we just put a roller below the machine, and uh, we replace another uh, two or three rollers uh, with the machine. That's normal three rollers. So when one is printing, uh, your operator could uh, put socks on on the other two sides uh, roller. So the operation will be save some time. So the process is done. And for protective uh, paper, you don't have to replace every pair of socks because uh, as long as uh, it's not so much ink, not dirty uh, on the socks on the on the paper, so you don't have to replace. Yeah, yeah, and uh, just put it there and uh, replace another loader. So this one pair is done, and uh, just click print for next pair. Also, uh, the operator needed to align, where align the socks about the height because uh, every socks is same. So you have to don't need to do again again. Just to make alignment on the socks curve and uh, stretch it flat. And uh, make uh, make sure the uh, printer working. Uh, environment is uh, like uh, about about 20 degree to 30 degree and also we have humidity here so like uh, 40 to 60 percentage of humidity actually today is a bit cold now the working environment is only 10 So take off socks. It's easy to pull out because there's a sticker here. So another one. Just pull out. Not touch the socks uh, surface because it's wet. It's wet. So this can be reduced for next pair. And we see there's already some ink on the edge. So next time when you uh, put on the other pair, you just pull to that part and stop and make alignment in the machine. So that's it. And later, uh, there's the heating process. The color uh, doesn't look uh, very uh, bright until it gets uh, heated, the color will show out.